And hey, at five, we told you about how Hartfield Day overcame that now lifted postseason ban. But hey, let's talk about the Patriots now who have run the gauntlet of a schedule to start this season, and they almost came through it undefeated. Now their first loss of two came to Pulaski Academy. That was a heartbreaking last second 40 yard field goal to keep Coach Davis and the Patriots from its first win over the Arkansas Powerhouse. And then later to Oak Grove falling in double overtime to the top ranked school in 7A in Mississippi. Now MRA faces another top dog, 8-0 Hartfield in its own district. The Patriots say the tough schedule has prepared them well, but they still need to be better. I'm proud of them for fighting, but we expect to win. We got to, make, you know, we make one or two more plays, we win. So, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's not about just trying to play close. We try to win. Losing by two points, losing by one point, it's one of those things where, like, you as your team, you're like, hey, we played our butts off, but we could have just put a little bit more into it, and all of us agree, all of us try to work on it the next week, all of us put more work into the next week, and we're just trying to get 1% better every single day. MRA lost to Hartfield last year on another last second play, a fate they desperately want to avoid for a third time this season. Now, hey guys, I'll have much more on this matchup here tonight coming up in just a little bit in sports, but for now, reporting live in Flowood, I'm Bradley Davis, WAPT Sports.